Okay, carve a new place, Midtown Manhattan okay. Delhi, ready to put jumps in the trunk of the mag I got the hardware, let's stop at the heights, pick up the endo Roll up a ball, man, go over this info okay. Some little nigga Davito, I hear he swearing he the man on the East Coast He's finito, Word. his boys is pussy, they never keep the heat close never. DC's about to see hell worse than the Bush folks Pushed in wigs, burned bodies and slipped The short-tempered member of Rebel Arms with the metal arms Dirt doer, turf cruiser, high off the Magawan, earth rulers My niggas move like it's desert storm Chumps is slain and we dumped the remains in the reservoir You can check my rap sheet resume, my repertoire when we prep for war I'm the first one with the weapon drawn A true soldier, loyal to the set we form Death before dishonor and I rep that till I'm dead and gone Until then, you got a problem on your hands A nigga that won't conform to following your plans Inciting riots, got niggas wildin' in the stand Might be the reason a kid catch a body for a grand I'm trying to put this so your mind can understand As a youth, the streets and music help guide me to a man Scars and bars, I'm giving them all during my war path And in the end, just put I'm a beast on my dog tags. Team Homie. Sway 7, Team Homie. We out here in Harlem, Club 7. You know how it is. What up? Shimsky, what up? It's your boy IQ the God. Team Homie all day. Bars on Rush, Paul Goyles. Harlem all day. We're gonna battle like other battles. You know, Bodenberg Raw got cooked. I see him online saying everybody he, he beat me. Then they ain't beat me. It, the fact that it may be debatable, though, I guess it kind of mean that he, he came close. Cause you know, but that's because I fucked up. It wasn't because what he did. He was regular Rosenberg Raw. I wasn't regular Swave. So that's just what that was. Now, I mean, I ain't really. It is what it is. He still got cooked, though. Rosenberg Raw. What up, nigga? She still got cooked. My highlight of 2013 was going to the Philippines. Pretty much. April 2013, I went to the Philippines, battled. The battle's online, actually. I battled this kid named Bataz. Shout out to Bataz, my nigga Mike Swift, Jay Horn. What up, y'all? Congratulations to my man Jay Horn. He just had a baby. Oh, matter of fact, 2013, September, I had a baby, so that's another highlight. But that's all rap. Rap-wise, it was going to Asia. I mean, Philippines. I said Asia. They gonna be mad. <laughs> to the Philippines. I went to the Philippines and you know, you know, um, shit was crazy. 10,000 people, we battled at um, Arvinetta Coliseum. For those who don't know what Arvinetta Coliseum is, if you're a fight fan, that's the same place that held Thriller in Manila, Ali versus Frazier. And you are a good fight fan. And I'm a huge fight fan. So, yeah, that shit was like, that, that particular fight in general, Thriller in Manila was crazy, you feel me? And to be in that same arena, Battle rapping, that shit is like, that shit is the ultimate that shit step up to me. You know what I mean? It was 10,000 people in there. Pretty we historical. don't pack 10,000 people here. And this was the Philippines. Yeah, that's you feel me? Historical. That's crazy. So I, I was, I, I, I feel good that I was a part of that. I thank God for shit like that. You know what I mean? Everybody know, you know what I mean? Aver been going at it for a little over a year now. And um, crazy. I can't this battle was supposed to have been happening if you ask me, but it's happening nonetheless, so the outcome is going to be the same. I'm going to kill that boy. For those who think different, I feel for y'all niggas, B. I'm not even going to talk shit. I'm going to just let y'all know. I'm going to kill that boy. That's just what it is. Hey, Verb, know what's up. And when we talked to him, he said that it wasn't about money, that... I mean, it was about money. It wasn't about him ducking you. That, that nigga's a goddamn money. lie. He's a goddamn lie. The nigga asked for 12000 for me first from Smack. You know what I mean? Then he was talking shit, talking about how he would have took. He tried to throw my man Poison Pen under the bus, talking about how Poison Pen ain't when he asked Poison Pen for $1,000 or some shit. He's lying because Vlad offered us two, and he said no to that. I was standing there, nigga. Like, shit was whack. Like, he made it He made it about money, you know what I mean? But money was being offered to him that he didn't want to take, you know what I mean? And then the 12,000 shit, like, nobody's giving you 12,000. Not, <laughs> like, cut it out, you know what I mean? And then it's going down in March, and I guarantee you he ain't get what he normally get. So, you did all this running for us to end up here anyway, you know what I mean? Like, it don't make no sense. <laughs>
But like I said, fuck it, it's going down. March 29th. Our Renettas, I know Ariana's in Chicago. Ariana's. Shout out Gracie and Big Cannon for setting it up. Mm -hmm. This weekend coming up, I'm going to Blackout in Canada. I can't tell y'all who I'm battling. Y'all gotta be kept in the dark about that. You know what I mean? Hence, Blackout. You know what I mean? So, but I'm going. This weekend, I'll be in Canada battling KO, King of the Die, KOTD. And March. Listen, what's good? A verb. After March, after A verb, I really. I'm gonna hit the road again. Shout out to my man Immortal Tech. We're going on the road again. I ain't really got too many battles planned as of yet. I had people calling me about it, but I ain't booked nothing that's edged in stone yet. So, but you know, I will have other battles after A Verb. You know what I mean? 2014, I'm gonna cap it off. I'm, I'm gonna end it. I'll probably stop battling in 2014, so I'm gonna have a couple battles during the course of this year. Permanently? Yeah, I think I'm gonna quit this shit. This gang is getting a little crazy. It's not living up to the codes that, you know what I mean? It was living up to it before. It's starting to turn into wrestling, and it used to be more like boxing. I don't even watch wrestling. You know what I mean? This shit is getting corny. Niggas is taking liberties. Niggas is crossing lines now. We men first. Before this battle rap shit, we men. You know what I mean? I never knew certain niggas lines, niggas touch your cross. nuts niggas and touch your face. Niggas too comfortable crossing them lines right now. And that's going to cause a problem. Yeah, like, and I, I know that I'm, I'm of... seeing the pattern. You know what I mean? Daylight rubbing ball sweat on a nigga face. That's crazy. You know what I mean? Somebody sent me a link the other day. About a month ago, a battle happened. I think it was in Virginia or something. Some black kid snuffed some white kid. You know what I mean? Mass snuffed Sirius Jones. Arsenal mush Sharon. Like, it's this lines being crossed. Being, uh, in the... A lot of shit is just crazy. I just don't want it to be on my end because I know what's going to happen if that shit get directed towards us. Yo, so I just don't want to be the chilling. cause or the reason why battle rap is over. I don't want niggas saying Team Homie ruined this shit because exactly. that's basically what's going to happen if that's niggas cross that line. And I, uh, so I feel like I'm going to just, I'm going to have fun for this year and then I'm going to just be a fan. I'm going to come to, I'm going to still be at all the events, but just as a fan, you know what I mean? Me and my niggas going to still blow heavy loud with the crowd. You know how we do, but just ask fans. Oh, we got oh, yeah. some shit planned. So, can you, can you give us any insight into that? Because they didn't want to tell we us. We about to be the first team with a magazine. Mm -hmm. Team Homie magazine coming soon. We got the album, the mixtape is on that piff right now, the yellow tape. You can go to that piff right now and get the mixtape. Mm -hmm. Also, get my man Bugs, Bogies, and Juice Boxes. That's on that piff. My album is on. I, on iTunes right now, son of a one on man. My man IP got hashtag black, and that's about to drop soon. Mm -hmm. um, Team Homie, we got Team Homie TV. We about to start doing mad movies and shit. We got the magazine coming out. I said that. And the we album. got a whole bunch of ventures that we working on. That the we, album was gonna be like the extra album. Crazy. Ball Goyus. We got a whole bunch of shit we working on, and I'm mm -hmm. I'm just trying to do with other battle teams or like I don't consider us a battle team but being that everybody else does I just want to do what everybody else hasn't done yet you know what I mean so ain't nobody really put out no magazine that's actual battle rappers or actual participants in it so you know what I mean? everybody else be like press and they got their little thing we're gonna start an actual magazine a team feel me okay. Can we write? We all write. So we all write. write. We you know all what I mean? write. We, you know what I mean? we ain't just gotta write rap. We can write articles. I'm a great writer. Yeah, we. My man, a great writer. You know what I mean? Together. We got some shit up the sleeve. Mm -hmm. oh, Time, yeah. oh, B. Yeah. Word up. Oh, yeah. Shout out to Jim Ski TV, B. She oh, in the man. hood. She out here in Harlem. She on boy. Club Seven. Club Seven with us right now. <laughs> Word the mother. Came by herself too, with mm -hmm. a with an expensive camera. She ain't scared. Oh, ain't nobody gonna friend. do nothing to her either. How y'all doing? I said, yo, speak with hood etiquette. I'm an inner city delegate. Ghetto fabulous. School of hard knock graduate. Harlem Avada walk the streets with a bop. Prefer a revolver, don't jam, easy to pop. Six shots, keep concealed. If this piece revealed, the flame from it is gonna help some beef get grilled. 
chill, I'm being too violent. Now understand, dog, it's not me, it's my environment, place I reside in, area I was born and raised, where we roll dice and put the winnings all on haze, where we keep privilege hitting in a plastic cup and make example why the herb niggas acting tough. That's what's up. Just tell me when you had enough so I could get back to bagging up. I'm a hustler, yo. Swave sever, I do all things. Trying to keep my head above water like New Orleans. Come, walk with me down the streets where I'm from. Come, visit my slums. Come visit my slums. With some of the toughest niggas done passed away and we gonna see if your bitch ass lasts a day.